I am filming a day in my life. I'm Ellie, I'm a third year law student. It's Monday and I have a couple of lectures to go to and then the day is sort of my own. So yeah, I'm just gonna take you along. To recap on the morning, I sort of woke up at about eight. I don't have a lecture until 10. So I had a slow morning, I woke up, got ready, um, had porridge for breakfast. Yeah, now I'm just gonna walk to my first lecture of the day, which is a commercial law lecture at 10. And then at 11, I also have a European law lecture. Uh, I also want to stress that every day is really different for me. Um, my lecture timetable is different. Sometimes if I'm particularly busy, I might not go to a lecture. Um, sometimes I recorded. My timetable is that most of my lectures do start at 10. So sometimes if I've woken up early or I've got a lot to do, I um, might head to the library from nine to 10 before my lecture and then go to my lecture at 10. Um, but today I've not done that and I'm just gonna start my day at 10 when my lecture starts. Also, while I'm in my room, I thought I would show you my lovely view um, of Trinity Court that I have from my bedroom because I live in college as a third year, um, which is quite nice, uh, very central. As Keys is a very central college. Um, I have nice views and it means that it's really quick and easy for me to get to the library or get about. So here is my view. Um, there is some construction going on at the moment. But it's a nice day. Um, and yeah. Uh, also, on my way to my lecture, I'm gonna do some washing. I tend to do my washing every two weeks and on a Monday, the laundry room is a little bit quieter. So I'm gonna, on my way out, put a wash on. Okay, I'm running to do my wash quickly. Um, I thought I would show you my staircase. These are the stairs that I have to um, walk up and down. I have counted them and there is about 45. Um, gets a bit tiring. And then all my name, all of our names are on the door. And then when I get out the stairs and come down some more stairs, I'm in Gonville Court, which is nice. Well, it's really pretty. And I have the washing. Here's the chapel. This is uh, Keys Court. These are the gates that when I graduate in June, I will walk through. And then I carry on walking. And then my washing is in that door over there. So it's pretty nice. I don't have to walk far with my washing and then I'll just collect it after my lecture. So I am back in my room. I've had my two lectures. Um, first one was commercial, which was good. And then the second was EU. Commercial is a smaller module in third year. So that was a bit quieter. And then European law is uh, a compulsory third year module. So everyone is there. The law faculty here is lovely. And it is right by um, Keys first year accommodation, which is part of the reason why I chose Keys actually. Um, it was nice that in first year I'd be able to roll out of bed uh, and then be at Sidwick site, which is the site where all the different humanities faculties are um, and law faculty is there. And then I have walked back, collected my washing, hung it out. And then I think I ended up getting trapped at Sidwick site for a bit, uh, intentionally speaking to all of my friends. That's one of the nice things about Sidgwick. Uh, all the different buildings being there, you bump into everyone that you know. Um, it's quite social, it breaks up the day a bit. 
So yeah, and now I am going to go to lunch with my friends. Uh, at Keys, we have something that we call MDR, uh, which is called the minimum dining requirement where we pay for 36 meals up from. Um, so I'm going to use one of those meals for lunch and eat in hall with my friends. And then, yeah, then I'll get on with the rest of my day. And yes, I do washing and it feels very adult. And then you see my bed and I have my teddy bears. So yeah. Okay, I'm back in my room now after lunch and I'm just going to read over some of my dis stuff because I'm doing a dissertation this year which is one of the optional modules that you can do um, in third year and it's definitely my favourite module by far, I really enjoy it um, but I have a meeting with my dissertation supervisor at 2.30 um, and it's 2 o'clock now, the bells have just rung um, so I'm going to spend 15 minutes just reading over my dis um, stuff because I have a few questions that I'd like to ask her and get some clarification on um, but I want to have read it all through and it be fresh in my mind so that I can make the most of my 15 minute meeting with my supervisor and really make sure I ask all my questions um, thoroughly. So I'm going to look over that and then I'm going to walk um, through King's College back to Citrix site, the law faculty, to meet her That'll be a 15 minute meeting and then I will probably um, head into Gombling Keys Library for the rest of the day. Um, so yeah, that's my plan. Okay, it's six o'clock, my hair has got scraped back. I've been in the library from three till six after my meeting. And now I am walking across town to go to Sainsbury's to get some food for dinner. Everyone in Cambridge seems to call Sainsbury's Mainsbury's because there's two Sainsbury's and this is the main one or the big one, which is nice because Keys is so close to it. So I always just by myself dinner like every couple of days it saves me having to think really far ahead about what I want to go to the shops because it's so close um so yeah so I'm gonna get dinner for tonight and then um I'll have the food ready for after spin well you completely forgot to film it but I did just go to a spin class which was really really difficult from 7.15 to 7.45 with someone that I live with and then now um, I'm going to Feminist and Gender Society uh, Read Between the Wines Night, which is a wine and cheese night where we are celebrating female authors. So I'm just heading down. Hello, the wine and cheese night was really nice. We just um, discussed female authors that we recommend and like stories based around females which was nice uh, I recommended Wild Swans uh, which is an intergenerational 
um, book about three different generations of um, Chinese women. It's a very interesting book, very informative, but also a great read. And yeah, other books were thrown around like Babel and Song of Achilles, um, which are some cult favourites right now. So yeah, so that was really nice. Had some cheese, had some wine. And now um, it's nine o'clock. Uh, it's quite a busy day, I think. Spin class has really knocked me out and I'm gonna have a really quick, easy pasta dinner. And then I'm gonna shower, get into bed and watch The Office. And then I'll probably go to sleep at like 11. And then wake up and do the whole day again tomorrow when I have a 10 a.m. lecture tomorrow. And I have a supervision tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed my day in the life. I just wanna say that every day is really different. On a Saturday, for example, we have brunch every Saturday in college hall. So I will just have brunch um, at 11 and then I'll go to the library from there. So I have quite a chill morning. Some days I get up and go to the library at nine if I have a bit more to do or I just have woken up early and I want to go. I have 10 a.m. lectures Monday to Friday, which some people wouldn't like. I'm just happy not to have 9 a.m.s to be honest and I don't mind getting up and going to them. It sort of forces me to start my day and it gives me like a bit of a routine and structure, which I like. So yeah, every day is different. Some days I go to the library, some days I have supervisions, some days I go to Cafe Nero, other days I do nothing. Sunday, I had a great day off. But this was today and I hope you enjoyed it. I really recommend that you just apply to Cambridge because I just don't see why not. I just applied because I went to an open day and my mum said, why would you not try? These people have done it, you could do it. And here I am. So yeah, so thanks everyone for watching and um, I hope everyone's doing okay.